Well, I think it's the 28th of uh, November here, and um, sitting around figuring out what I could do because I can't be out on the snow. And uh, I'm going to go over a little bit about the Nidecker binding and the issue that I had the other day, uh, which was uh, stepping in, stepping out. In order to make a good fitting on your lead foot, you must transfer weight to that side. I'm moving to the left side here. Stomp down. That allows me to have a light right foot. Put it over. Then I must move my body to the right. Stomp down on it in order to get a fitting. But what I actually discovered was something interesting. If you look at the uh, binding setup here right now, and I'm going to kind of flick this piece, you'll notice that this piece is quite loose and it flicks whatever. So the joints right here are relatively loose. I'll come over to this, this one over here, and you'll notice that as I flick it out, um, the uh, cradle for the heel stays there. So that's an indicator that my uh, settings here on the side, these little star pieces here, if I can come in on them, uh, right in that area right there where it pivots, are tight. So in order to fix that, um, you need to do a couple of different things. One, you'd have to have a screwdriver that fits between here. I don't, but I do have the right fitting which is this fitting here, which is a star fitting. If you can kind of move in here, you can see it's a star. That star fitting is a T25, and it fits right into this piece like that. But what I don't have is a screwdriver that will allow me to get in between the two, two pieces here in order to loosen it a little bit. But what I do have is a mind that tells me I could solve that. So I'm going to take a small ratchet wrench here and I'm going to go ahead and work that by putting that over my fitting. I do want to turn this to, come on now, don't, don't mess up the video. The left. So I can break that loose a little bit. I'll have to redo this part. Okay, so you can see the uh, T25 fitting there and everything and uh, how that went. But I'm going to move over here to the binding really quick, to the system. And uh, the, the, two, the two screws uh, that, are, that are being used here are the two where the cradle is um, and the, both sides of the screen there. I did, in fact, turn these pieces out right here too far and they were actually sticking out a bit. So what I did to solve my problem was, additionally, I went into the garage and grabbed this can of three-in-one garage door lubricant. So with the tool and the lubricant, I'll slap back over here, and now that I put the screws in where they are properly spaced and not sticking out too much, you can see I have my release and my fall away back, so hypothetically, I've solved that problem. Uh, the only thing I would need to do as uh, the season goes on is make sure that these pieces right here on both sides remain tight and don't get loose and start to come out. But taking care of that, uh, that sticking problem, and if you have it, that's how you can solve it. Uh, this goes to show you that when I check out gear, I'm going to check it out all the way. So anyhow, shred ahead. Thanks for joining us.